Yo, Scorpio, this is Spiritual Goddess. How y'all doing? How y'all been? What's up? Thank you for all of your love and support. I truly appreciate it, and it goes unnoticed. Well, let's just see what spirit needs you to know right now regarding life situations that's going on around you. Let's clarify those situations. So, you all have inner vision. Cut through the fog of confusion with your power of discernment. So someone could have blue eyes, green eyes. Um, river of release. Drift along the river of release where water carries away burdens, guiding towards renewal. And give me one more. Boom, that was smooth. New worlds. There are many, there are many more new things for you to discover. So don't give up. So the first card says, cut through the fog of confusion with the power of discernment. So both of these cards have fog. Maybe there's something that you can't envision because you can't see clearly because there's a lot of confusion and fog regarding where you're where you're supposed to be heading, Scorpio. And spirit is saying that there is going to be obstacles that are that you're going to endure. There are going to be things that you're going to have to carry along the way. But spirit is saying when those obstacles approach, you have to have power of discernment. So what they're saying is they need you to open your eyes. We're going to find out what's tea regarding this situation. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember, so we keep it real, raw, and uncut, and I keep it a buck if you don't like how it's being told. Baby, you can exit stage left. Nobody is forcing you to be here. Remember, my name isn't Ike, and yours isn't Tina. <laughs> so nobody's forcing you to eat the cake, anime. <laughs> legal issues. So maybe there's something that you just don't see regarding this legal issue. Um... Maybe there's a divorce that's happening. You don't see how it is a win for you. Or maybe there's something that you have been battling um, for the last couple of years. And it's now coming to um, to like the days where the trial period where you have to actually face this. Um, or maybe you're sitting alongside someone who is facing some sort of jail time. We need some more tea on this, huh? Give me more tea regarding this. What else is going on around Scorpio? You got groupie. And the inside scoop. So a closer look. Nosy up in your business. So spirit is saying, cut through the fog of confusion with the power of discernment. So it's something that you don't have all the information about. And that's what's creating the obstacles for you. Maybe it's something pertaining to this legal situation. Maybe there is something that you overlooked regarding your court situation. Maybe there's somebody who's been going through this same situation You know, like, uh, what is it, others, other, um, what do you call it, other cases, other lawyers that have won these cases. Maybe there are other cases that are exactly like yours, and maybe if you are overlooking something that could actually be beneficial to you. Or maybe this is a fucking, uh, babe, you know, custody battle, and you got all these extra ass groupie holes that your baby daddy or baby mama is dealing with that are interfering and trying to dig dirt up on you i mean this situation can go so many different ways but spirit is saying you have to have discernment around the people that's that you are letting be around you because somebody is either digging or they need you to dig a little bit more around the people that you're affiliated with because it might be 
this might help you in your, this might be a negative or a positive impact to your legal situation. You feel me? So let's take it like that. Ooh. Let's just dig into it. Spirit, what is the legal issue? So, traveling. Oh, no, I'm talking about traveling. Three of Wands. To the gap. Three, three could be significant, or you could be the age 33. Um, with the world card in, re in reverse. So, maybe there's some sort of divorce, a custody, a custody battle. Maybe you are having to... Um, what do you call that? Split things down the middle. Maybe there is something that you are fearful for because maybe you do have to go back home, possibly live with your mom or, you know, your parents until you get back on your feet. You know what I'm saying? Go let, stay with family until you get back on your feet with you and your kids or something like that. Maybe that's what's holding you back or making you feel like you are a failure or something along those lines, making you feel like you haven't accomplished much or this relationship is was very unsuccessful. But you got some groupies on the side. So again, maybe somebody was offering these groupies a whole lot of extra love. <laughs> I'm telling you, <laughs> broke up this happy home maybe that's what spirit is telling you pay attention to the people that's surrounding you scorpio you need to take a closer look because the people that's surrounding you you need to dig a little bit deeper because they ain't friends bucko these friends ain't friends they might be a couple foes in here that might be the result of your legal issues these groupies might be the result of your legal issues breaking up this happy home causing pain and this is why source is saying you need to have a spirit of discernment it needs to be strong right now you need to heal from this because there is a whole new world for you you got to push through this push through the fog Yeah. Somebody out there pouring all their love to everybody else. Ain't doing nothing but creating unhappy homes. That's all they did. And it could be this King of Pentacles. Somebody who think they are just a boss daddy. <laughs> Somebody think they can flex and get what they want and they can use their money to to acquire the acquire these groupy ass souls. I'm hearing these uh plastic bodies or something like that, or somebody who feels that they have to have the latest shit go and get the I'm I'm hearing balloon breasts or something like that. It's like these people mind is about looking good and 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 keeping up with the Joneses. You feel me? Not this realistic shit. It's like this your person went and cheated with a Barbie. Somebody who what is that the 8020 rule? Y'all go back to that. They had an 80 at home. And went to a 20. We're going to put that in. The, I think they're going to make that decide. 80-20 80, 80, rule or something like that. This is King Dingaling. Felt that because he carries the bag that he can do as he please. As long as the house is being taken care of. But in in <laughs> while doing so, you are dragging down the one person who has your bag. Yeah, you can provide all you fucking want, but you out here giving it and flipping it and dipping it with everybody else. I'm telling you, it could be up to seven bitches. Seven guys. <laughs> Somebody just playing. Has a lot of choices. What's this um inside scoop that spirit is saying you need to get or you need to dig in? This empress in reverse. I don't know. Somebody who's already a mother. Maybe you need to check on them kids and get a DNA test on one of them friends you hanging around with. Because somebody's kid is not 
who they claim it to be. It might be your husband's or your wife's. I mean, not your wife's, but you know what I'm trying to say. Might be your homie's baby. Your wife then stepped out with your homie whole time and pinning this baby on you. Or your friend has been sleeping with your husband the whole time. And that baby that's her, your god child is, is actually your god, your, your stepchild. It's giving some Jerry Springer type shit. Somebody who you grew up with from, from, from childhood on me. This person could be a Taurus or you could deal with a, could be dealing with a Scorpio. But this person is someone who you grew up with. Oh, heavy Scorpio. I didn't even read this. This is heavy Scorpio right here. And I'm talking about Scorpio. So Scorpio, you could be dealing with another Scorpio friend. This is somebody who you consider your bestie, your ride or die, your Scorpio best friend who is sleeping with your man. And this is why spirit is saying dig deeper. She is right underneath your nose. The information that you seek is right there. If I'm lying, I'm fucking flying. This bitch is, I'm telling you. You, you think you don't have a way out. The information that you seek is right underneath your nose. It's like you feel like you are losing so much because of this divorce, because of this person and how they got lawyers. They probably got more, more money for better lawyers or something like that. They money a little long so they can pay for, pay for attorney fees and all that type of shit. And here you are, you feel like your back is against the wall and you have nowhere to fucking go. And the whole time, the same bitch that you confiding into, dig. She's the one right there that has been sleeping with your man. Put that shit out on the table. It's already in your intuition. Follow it. Clarify this um, groupie. Ooh. Clarify this groupie. A page of pentacles. Someone who is very childish, lacks ambition, <laughs> lacks common sense like this is a person who you are guiding like not even guiding this is someone who fuck it you're guiding she looks up to you wants to be like you she admires you that just is what it is yeah spirit is saying dump this motherfucking zero this groupie hoe just wanted to be like you what what it don't even matter. And she could be possibly younger than you, a younger earth sign. Ooh, ooh, I hope it's not a sibling. Um, but again, this person is very childish. They come up as a page of pentacles. Come on now. This is some bitter, bitter, somebody who is a... a, a <laughs> a mother but is very childish at heart they lack common sense they like common sense ain't common to them like it is really not they lack it like again it's like they can watch a movie right 1333 and see a friend on tv smashing um her friend's husband and be like well what did the wife do to cause that like <laughs> it'd be some weird shit like that you be saying that like what the fuck you mean? What the wife to do to cause that? You, this, you're my, dying. you be looking like, wait, bitch, like, that's her whole best friend and her whole husband. They have no business mixing those two, period. And you're sitting there trying to understand it. And she's like, I don't see the problem. What did the wife do? Maybe the wife wasn't, um, you know, um, supportive enough. Like, you're sitting there shocked. She's going to say some weird shit like that. It's weird. It's giving weird. Again, if you have been the life of the party, because when you step out with your friends, you're able to have a ball, but because it's on, you know, your expense, you know, your family's expenses, because yes, you, you know, y'all have, you're married, you come from a, what you thought was a stable foundation. So maybe you were the friend that paid, you know, for, you know, like the, 
you know, like the boat rentals, you know, stuff like that. You treated everybody. It's something along those lines. Like if you looked out, you you looked out. If she didn't have it, you will look out. And this person feels that they can take your place. That's why spirit says, stand the fuck up. Protect. You got to speak the fuck up. You got to get down and dirty with them. You got to get back, sit back and observe and take notes. You got to shut up and take notes because they are doing this shit right behind your back. You got to be like a thief in the night to get this information so you can take to your goddamn lawyer. This is what's up. Because this person don't want whatever they went in. I'm feeling like I'm getting that this feeling like this person went down and filed for divorce or they wanted they they went and sought legal action to separate themselves from you you feel me scorpio they went and did this shit to separate from you so it makes you look like the bad person you feel me like oh, it's just not working anymore and i just feel like we've grown apart whole time the reason why they went down there to the court system and requested for a divorce is because they've been cheating with the bestie not because you two have grown apart. Uh, what is it in reckless? What do you call that? Uh, uh, I can't even think of the fucking word. Uh, the difference. What the fuck? Whatever. Y'all are on two different pages. That type of shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's what they went down there and lied and said. But no, 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 no. The whole purpose is of this person, this king of pentacles, they just want to be free. That just is what it is. They want to be free and give and fuck and suck on whoever they want to be with. And that just is what it is. They probably feel they jumped the gun too fast and started this family too fast. And now they want out. And the only way out they felt was to go down there and lie. But the whole time is they got hidden secrets. They have a, they have shit that's, that they have, be, that, that, that needs to be revealed. They grass ain't clean, baby. They grass ain't cut low. It snakes all in that shit. You feel me? They closet is not that fucking clean. Their closet is very dirty and dark. And what's done in the dark will come to light again. That's why spirit is saying stand up and protect yourself. Take a deeper look into these groupie bitches that you hang around or these groupie niggas that you hang around. Check your friend group. Your friend group it might be turning up to some foes. I'm telling you. Once you find out this information, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this shit changes every fucking thing. It brings balance to this whole situation. Follow your intuition, Scorpio. Follow your intuition. I'm telling you. Don't sit up here and feel trapped. Feeling defeated, like you have no fucking way to go, and letting these motherfuckers talk behind your back, thinking they got one up on you when they don't. They're snakes. They're fucking snakes. Call fucking judgment on these hoes. It's time to put in that work. You have to get quiet and observe. And I'm trust. I'm, and I'm, trust me. The the evidence, the truth will come out. Pay attention to how they're moving. It's something about the way that they move and they talk. It, it, it's in the words. It's in the dialogue. You have to pay attention to that, Scorpio. I'm telling you, pay attention. Final thought. King of Cups. I'm telling you, this person, your person loves to come out and act like they're so put together they're so um emotionally stable they're so secure at providing for the house whole time this person is a manipulator a conniving ass excuse my french you feel me this is a snake this is somebody who wears many masks time to call judgment on this hoe and let this shit let this shit be what it is. Don't feel like you're defeated. You got one up. You don't realize this groupie is in your friend group. 
Divine masculine, divine feminine. Check your friend group. Because this hoe is there. You could be dealing with a Leo born on the first. Or, uh, the first. The first. <laughs> or life path one. Or you could be dealing with a Sagittarius born on the second. <laughs> or life path two. Or you could be dealing with a Cancer born on the fifth. Or life path five. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for all of your love and support. I truly appreciate it. And remember, it goes unnoticed. And soon as I finish this move, we're back to our free readings. Again, thank you for all of your love and support. Namaste.